High school girls basketball, Millard Trail hosting Pikeview and Heiko. First quarter, a Lady Panther bounce pass intercepted by Addie Isaacs. Quickly going the other way, almost loses the ball, but she scores from close range as Millard Trail is on the board first. At the other end, Cat Farmer finds Hannah Perdue open on the left wing for a long two, but it's good. Lady Patriots, though, with the lead in the opening minutes. Isaacs forcing another turnover in the backcourt, heading the other way to finish this pick two on her own. 10-5 to five the lead at that point. But then Pikeview would go on a run to take the lead. Riley Meadows from the left wing. Bounce pass to Hannah Harden. She has space to score from the right side. 16-11 to 11 the score after one. That lead would grow in the second. Farmer on the right wing to Meadows, who goes between defenders for this basket from close range. Bill and Trail trying to answer late in the second. Briley Stevenson with a bounce pass to Megan Gill. Open for this layup from the right side. But Pikeview adding to its lead before halftime as the Lady Panthers win on the road. Final score 65-38. to 38. Boys basketball in Fayette County, a Class 4A matchup between Oak Hill and Greenbrier East. Spartans get off to a very hot start in the first quarter. Monquel Davis with a turnover, racing in to finish the basket on his own. Spartans leading by double digits at one point in the first, but Oak Hill responds. Ethan Vargo Thomas with this layup and the foul as the Red Devils are within one going to the second quarter. Jude Libby connecting with Adam Seams, who converts this layup from underneath the basket and Greenbrier East extending their lead, but Omar Lewis answering with two points of his own for Oak Hill as this game would remain close going into the second half and on a Red Devil possession in the third quarter. Lewis to Jacob Perdue on the left side. Into the paint, knocking down this jumper, and we are tied 39 all after three. But then in the fourth quarter, East ball seems to Goose Gabbert for three from the left wing. Counted. It'd be a close game throughout the night, but Greenbrier East wins on the road. Final score, 57-52.